Hey everybody, it's Jared Akers, sitting out uh, back on the back patio, watching, waiting for the little bunnies to come running around. We have these little bunnies that that uh, kind of uh, run around in our backyard. There's a mom, I think, and a little baby, and they kind of come up and eat the grass, and so we kind of sit here and watch them. My wife's not home right now. She's She's at work, but I wanted to talk about the idea, concept of walking the walk, you know, and you talk the talk and you walk the walk. Because my wife and I were talking about this the other day because she had, my wife had an emergency appendectomy. And so a couple weeks ago, and it was on a Monday night, she wasn't feeling very well. She worked all day. And then, you know, we went in, finally, you know, we live just a few blocks from the hospital. And I said, you know, your body tells you when you need to go and something serious and so she tried to go to bed and she couldn't and, and so we ended up going to the hospital and you know and they they did some tests and you know and then it was like well we need to do CT scans and so it's oh my gosh you know then we're sitting there and she has some history of cancer and heart problems in her family and and uh, you know it really hit hit us and that this could be something serious and we talk about faith a lot and and we're like you know we're gonna you know get a chance maybe to see if we can walk the walk and uh it was interesting and it ended up being a a uh well they removed her app and her appendix but they also found a hematoma behind uh back behind her uh something something and uh <laughs> you know she was in surgery for almost two hours hour and a half out and forty something like that and the surgeon came out and he said, you know, it wasn't really what we expected, but, you know, I removed the appendix anyway. And, you know, but it makes you realize that when you see somebody, it could be the last time you see them. And that's just, you know, we all know that. But do we really practice the concept of making sure we let people know how much they mean to us? And, and although I certainly couldn't imagine a life without my wife, Emily, because she's my person, you know, my, my best friend. And. I know that I would be okay um, because we've talked about it, you know, and our happiness isn't contingent on, on each other. We, we're both very faithful um, and we both know that we can exist without the other, but life is certainly joyful on a grander scale with each other and, you know, but it, it's just a good reminder to make sure that if you have any grudges or you're fighting or you know, really stop and think, why are you angry? Is it pride or is it your ego? And move past that and realize that, you know, how precious life is. And we all know that, but do we practice it? So anyway, that's just something I was thinking about. And uh, my book is done. I'm working on a special promotional deal. And uh, it, it's, it's actually on Amazon right now, so you can find it on Amazon. But... Um, if you're on my email list, you're going to get a special deal for that as well for the book and uh, some pretty cool offers. And Anyway, um, that's it. Thanks for stopping by. JaredAcres.com.